Supply your ego with all the love that it needs. The ego's quest for external achievements and self-importance really stem from one thing, a sense of incompleteness. When you love your ego, what you're doing is you're beginning to separate yourself, the parent apart from the child. And so then the parent can begin to love the child, the child being the ego, the parent being the soul or the spiritual part of you. You see, if you're caught up and confused, then you let the child run amok and it feels incomplete because the parent never gives it any love. But when you begin to practice your spiritual growth and recognize your unfoldment apart from the ego, you can then love and express that love more fully to the ego and thus complete it. And a complete ego is less mad and more easily tamed. For more tips on how to live your full potential, visit fullpotential.com.